All right, what's up, you guys? I'm here with the Mick Foley WWE DVD collection. So we have four different DVDs here, and so let's get right into it here. We also have Mr. Sacco chilling. All right, so in 2001, we got our first Mick Foley DVD, Hard Knocks and Cheap Pops. This was only the 10th DVD made, so very early release. So basically what this one is, I'll show you the insert. You have your chapters, which is kind of like, you know, a lot of DVDs were like that back then, like the Hell Yeah or um, the Rock DVD. You know, a lot of them just have chapters, like informative chapters about um, their life, their career, and um, some of their matches. Like for this one, it talks about his WrestleMania 2000 match. It talks about his Rumble Street Fight, his No Way Out Hell in a Cell match. It talks about his different rivalries. And talks about him being a commissioner, of course. So, back here we do have a few matches. We have Mankind versus Shawn Michaels, Mind Games. Mankind versus Stone Cold Steve Austin. Another one with The Rock. And then we have Dude Love versus Stone Cold Steve Austin. And then Al Snow versus Big Boss Man. And you have um, some more extras there. Pop Music, Commissioner McFoley, Mankind, Dude Love, and Cactus Jack. So, the following matches were handpicked by Mick Foley himself, and he considers them to be his favorite. So, there's only WWF matches on here. Nothing um, from ECW or, you know, very early career matches. Nothing from that. So, getting on to 2004, we'll just have, just have him chill there. 2004, we got a two-disc set with a six-and-a-half-hour runtime, Mick Foley's Greatest Hits and Misses. And this is your basic compilation set from WW, um, WWE, SMW, which was Smoky Mountain, ECW, and then WCW. 90 minutes of DVD extras. Opening it up here, we have your two discs. One with Mankind and then Cactus Jack. So we do get an insert for this one. If I can get it out nicely. Alright, so your basic pamphlet insert here. But, you know, you have your different matches here from D WCW. Um, we have ECW, Smoky Mountain Wrestling, of course. And the extras... Um, you just have some interviews, promos, and then more matches. So, yeah. But we have matches with Big Van Vader. Uh, tag team matches with the Nasty Boys. You have versus Sabu, Chris Candido versus The Sandman. Uh, Cactus Jack and Raven versus Terry Funk and Tommy Dreamer. And then Cactus Jack versus Mikey, uh, Mikey Whipwreck from ECW. Big Ass Extreme Bash. From 96. And then post Vader match interview, we have Cactus Jack versus Sting um, when he spits on the WCW belt in ECW. We have the Kane Dewey promo, anti hardcore promo, Cactus Jack and um, Sabu rematch, ECW farewell speech. I'm not going to name all the extras here. <clears throat> uh, you have his match with Shawn Michaels at Mind Games again, match with Hunter Hearst Helmsley. Terry Funk, Stone Cold, The Undertaker, The Rock, and Triple H. Um, so, you also have the Hell in a Cell with The Undertaker as well. And, um, let's see. Just more extras down here. Birth of Mr. Sacco. That's definitely... If I had to pick one Monday Night Raw moment as my favorite, it would be the bedpan. So, yeah, you know, that was also the debut of Mr. Sacco, so... That's pretty cool. So on the back here, we just have Mankind. And then in 2007, they released a different edition of this. The Hardcore Edition. And you can see it has... It's the same content, but it also has the Dude Love bonus disc, which is really cool. And that just features some extra matches. It's kind of strange, though. Um, it still has a six and a half hour runtime, 
um, but it still gives, um, it doesn't count the hardcore bonus disc, uh, which is interesting. So, and all these matches, the bonus ones, have alternate commentary from McFoley and Joey Styles. So that's really cool. If I can get this out here. You can also get a WWE magazine. Alright, so the bonus matches. Uh, Mick Foley versus Randy Orton from Backlash 2004. Mick Foley versus Edge, WrestleMania 22. Um, one of my personal favorites, Mick Foley and Edge with Lita versus Terry Funk and Tommy Dreamer with Beulah. And then his I Quit match with Ric Flair at SummerSlam. And you can see uh, the insert's a little different, but it's still the same content. So, you know, pretty cool. If you have the Hardcore Edition, definitely get that one. I, of course, have both. And you can see the difference there. Not much of a difference, just color scheme. I don't know which one I prefer look-wise. Probably the original. Alright, so, and finally, we got For All Mankind, The Life and Career of McFoley. Really cool cover here with Mr. Sacco, of course. A three-disc tail. And this was released in 2013 with a, I'm assuming, yeah, six and a half hour runtime. Kind of short. You just have some different screenshots there. And this does give you the documentary treatment, which we'll get into in a minute. You have Santa Claus, Mick Foley, Mankind. You have the barbed wire bat, hardcore title, Do love, commission, uh, commissioner. Well... I'm assuming that's Cactus Jack, yeah. I mean, he has the wanted shirt on. So all the personas of Mick Foley, pretty cool. And then the discs are really cool as well. You have the flannel, you have the mankind mask, and then the dude love tie-dye. All right, so the actual documentary is actually very well done. Uh, obviously, it talks about his childhood, how he got into wrestling. Um, he was actually in Madison Square Garden when... Jimmy Snuka jumped off the cage, uh, talks about his um, training school, how he got into WCW, talks about his rivalry, uh, rivalries with Sting and Vader, talks about ECW in Japan, and then it obviously goes into his different gimmicks like Mankind, Dude Love, and then his run in WWF, Hell in a Cell of course, his run with as Commissioner. His time away, it talks about him being an author, uh, New York Times best-selling author. Uh, it talks about his family. And also gets into his brief return in 2006. And then um, him being a stand-up comic. So, very good documentary. One of their better ones in recent years. Alright, so, we have Jack Foley and Les Thornton versus the British Bulldogs. Cactus Jack and Gary Young versus Scott Steiner and Billy Travis. Cactus Jack Manson versus Brickhouse Brown. Cactus Jack versus Keith Hart. You have a match against Sting. Matches with Van Hammer, Sandman, Shane Douglas, uh, Rocky Maivia, and Hunter Hearst Helmsley. And then you have another one with Rock. Um, you, of course, have the Hell in a Cell match, of course. Um, with alternate commentary. Mankind and Kane versus the New Age Outlaws. Mankind versus The Rock. Mankind and The Rock versus Triple H and Shane McMahon. Mankind versus Al Snow. And then No Way Out, Cactus Jack versus Triple H, the Hell in a Cell match. Surprisingly, 2000 is the latest this one goes. No artwork behind there either. Yeah. Oh, well. So, you know, it doesn't get into his um, his returns or anything like that. But um, Mick Foley, he's had some great DVD treatment. I think this one could have done a little bit better. But overall, I'd say the one to get. Uh, I'd say the Hardcore Edition, Mick Foley. Greatest hits and misses. But that's just my opinion. So I hope you guys enjoyed. This has been the DVD Freak. Peace out.